Okay, so we're playing Floygan Brothers for the Dreamcast. Episode 1. Why are we doing that? Look, do you have any comprehension of how relevant Floygan Brothers is in video game history? Floygan Brothers is a game made by Visual Concepts for Sega. It was a Dreamcast exclusive. Um, it was actually a game that came out after the Dreamcast died. The Dreamcast was discontinued March 31st, 2001. This game came out four months later, July 30th, 2001. It was just so good. They could not cancel it. They had to get it out. Didn't matter that the system was done. Here's a little a little extra, a little bonus for you with Floygan Brothers for you Dreamcast loyalists out there. And why is this relevant to today's video games? Well, you might notice it says episode one. This wasn't. This was supposed to be an episodic game. That wasn't something that really existed at the time. There was like there were some experiments, but like that's not something that became really common or popular until many years later. No. Then what is it? Well, they're, they're gonna have to play and find out. <gasps> Can we play too? We always do. <laughs> Like, ten years later. And... I should mention... There was no episode two, because the Dreamcast was done. Uh, and this game, apparently, is very short. And my understanding is that... It... When it first came out, it sold for $20. So, a reduced price, this was actually supposed to be... An episodic thing. And then the Dreamcast owners would buy episode two for $20 whenever it was supposed to come out. We're going to start a game. So this is an extremely relevant piece of video gaming history, and you should respect it. Honestly, though, the thing that people primarily remember this game for was Bernie Stoller saying that this game would be for Sega what the Mario Brothers were for Nintendo. And I... Why would... He, why would he say that? Why would he... Why would he play it up so big? It's really nothing at all like Mario, as far as I can tell. Look, you may have confidence in your game, but you really, sh you really should be careful about what you compare it to, I think. Um, okay, so. We're gonna play this for an hour. Apparently the game is actually not that much longer than that, but we're gonna play it for at least an hour and see what- See how it is. Let's- let's just say that. Let's get the game going. Okay. Cookies, tutorial, Moigle secret, that's the game. Go online? Oh, you remember the Dreamcast had a modem. Um, there was DLC. We'll talk about that later. Uh, let's just do the tutorial. Let's see, uh... What's a six-letter word that means genius? Michael. Oh, yeah, good. That's his yeah. name. What's a seven-letter word that means circles of sugary baked dough with chocolate chips in them? Cookies. Let's make cookies. If we're going to make cookies, we need sugar. Pass me the sugar bowl, big brother. It's on the table. All right, let me add that sugar. Well, let me add it. All right, here we go. Tutorial time. I am too short. I cannot get that sugar. So we're going to get here. If, can I move? Yeah, there we go. I can move the camera. Sugar makes cookies good. Okay. Get up here. There we go. Give him. Yeah, there we go. So the gameplay is basically the two of them have to help each other out with, with things like this. I don't know why he needs me to open this for him. He seems perfectly capable of opening this door. Can you point to the bottle, 
he cannot identify the butter on his own. He is extremely happy to be baking cookies. Chip cookie. We should probably add some uh, mm, chocolate. <laughs> Could you get the chocolate for me, Hoigo? It's up there on the top shelf. But how are you gonna get up there? We don't have a step ladder. Uh, let me check the manual. To get the chocolate, Hoigo should get Moigo. That would be me. To stand on the dizzy pad, then Hoigo should run around Moigo. If Hoigo runs fast enough, Moigo will get dizzy and faint. Then Hoigo can bounce on his belly like a trampoline to get to high places. Simple. <laughs> People do it all the time. Sounds All right. Can I just ask Moigo to please bounce on his soft belly like a trampoline instead of making him all dizzy? Okay, he's standing on it. And I guess I have to go around him? There we go. He's dizzy. He's going to follow. Okay. Uh, there we go. Whoop. I did not get on there. Let's do that again. Uh, there we go. Here are your chips. Take this. This is just really unpleasant to look at, isn't it? And when I say that, I'm not saying that it's badly made. I'm saying that they effectively made the graphics that they were trying to make. They just wanted it to look repulsive. I can hug him. Give me a hug, you big lug. <laughs> Thanks, Heidel. I needed that. Alright. Where was that? Where's that mitt? on top of something. Hand me the mint and we'll get some cookies. I'm standing over here. I don't see it on the top of that shelf. Is it on top of another shelf? I, I don't know why. I don't think it would be out here. You think it would be in the kitchen? Oh, no. There it is. There it is. It's not in the kitchen. Give me the mint, Hoigo. That's the oven mitt. Hand me the mitt and we'll get some cookies. Hey, Moigo, take this. <laughs> A little too much gunpowder in the sugar. And just gives the cookie some bite. Dang! Look what you made me do. You made me burn the cookie. That makes me Oh no, he has anger issues. Stand on that pad before I catch you. Maybe something cool will happen. This is an abusive relationship. You'd have to punch me to make me angrier. Ding dong, dinner, but you don't care about my needs. Okay. There, there we go. What about me? My needs. Maybe something cool will happen? And I don't think anything's cool is happening now.
I, no, I think we're still doing this. Oh, okay. He, he knocked me up there so I could grab the apple, so I could give it to him to sate his unending rage. What am I teaching? What am I teaching you? Uh, I teach him something new. Like a high five. It's just the first thing I can teach him. Okay, Moigle will high five with one hand or high ten with both hands. Use the analog stick to choose up, down, right, or left, and, pr and press five for one hand or ten for two. Press go to start or help for more instructions. Why is he taking his hand away? I'm too slow. Is this a contest? I lost a point and he gained one. You gotta have point, Tigo. Bribe him? With what am I bribing him for? Bribe him with a, a point? So do these brothers just have like a a constant competition with each other? Where they're constantly keeping points. The points don't really exist or mean anything. It's just a constant score that they're keeping with each other. I guess we're done with that. control of the train? I have to run and dive to catch the handle at the back of the train. I'm glad that they are training me to be able to handle situations in the future that will require these, um, whatever it is we're doing, we're doing here. There we go. I, I guess this is helping. A, a lot that's happening in just a few minutes. We completed our training. On to the main episode. Have fun? I mean, I'm not... Here's hoping. I don't have high hopes about it. I'm starting to think that maybe Sega's uh, high confidence in Floygan Brothers might not have been justified. I'm starting to suspect that. So that's what we'll do. You savvy? There's just so much movement happening all the time. You know a lot of things I don't know. Ask me. What is it? Okay, I'll bite. What is it? I'm not gonna tell you. Oh, you got me again. It's a surprise. <laughs> Go on, you big galoot. You're toying with my feelings. What's the surprise? Oh, no. You're not gonna trick me into telling you. Oh, he's sharp, I'm telling you. You gotta get up pretty early in the morning to pull the wool over your eyes. It's in the garage. But you can't go in. Well, all right. I'm building in there. Do you want to help me? I don't know. Do I want to help you? Sure you do. Sure I do. <laughs> Again, why do I ask? If you want to help me, you can help me find these seven things. It's part of the surprise. My little mouse friends will help us find them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mouse friends? You talk to mice now? Go now, big brother, go. There's no surprise without you, so just follow the mice. 
That's my little brother. He talks to rodents. All right, Moigle's secret project. Find se seven parts to finish the project. Watch out when his mood changes. You want to... You want to watch out for those mood swings. As we have seen, there might be something new to do, like hide. Don't forget that the mice can help them find the things that they are looking for. All right. Let's see. I can in insult to make him sad. Find out a bunch of game stuff. We can hug. We can teach. We can suggest a game to play. Uh, there's... Hey? I can just yell out, hey. I can point. I wanted to point something out for someone. There's an apple over there. Blue switch opens this gate, but I'm too slow to run that far by myself. Hey, what's up? I want you to use this right here. Is that what we're doing? Punch that. Speak. Teach? Uh... Lift me up? You need lots more points to teach me that. I do not have enough points to spend on him if I want to, him to learn how to pick me... He already picked me up, though. Anyway, so there's this that's connected to this. Okay, here's the actual switch. All right, here he comes. Well, I mean, I, I would want him to be able to hit that switch so I could go over there, but I don't... Hey! I don't think he's going to do that. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, yes? You choose a game this time. High five. Okay, okay we've, we've done this. Let's see if I do any better this time. Give me some. Gotcha. Give me some. Gotcha. Give me some. Oh, you faked me out that time. He, f he mixes it up, makes it tricky. I did a little better that time. Well, anyway. I can hit that switch, but like he said, I'm not going to be able to make this in time. Yeah, it just kind of closes like that. So we're going to have to figure something out there. There's that box, which I guess if I make him mad... Uh and break this box, I could stand on it, and he will abuse me in some way, which might open a puzzle? Uh, let's see, where is he? Hey, I want to get to the mailbox. I don't know where he is. There he is. Michael, help me get to the mailbox. Where is the mailbox? Is it across this river? Like, I see there's a gate over there that says it needs a key. Oh, wait, that's probably the mailbox over there. Welcome, Postal Man. I do not know how to get to there. Okay, there's like a gate. Sw a yellow switch opens... Oh, what are they saying over there? They had signs, but okay, they were pointing me towards this ladder. Must be some way to get to the mailbox. You think that living in this constant system of being scored is uh, would be very st very stressful? Hey, just constantly needing, feeling the need to build up points and fearing that you're going to lose them. All right, he got his package. Oh, wait. 
All right, we got the parcel. So I guess this is the list of things we need. So that time he pointed out what it was that we needed and then we went and solved it. I don't know if he'll do that every time. Or if there are some things that we will need to go find manually. Well, if he does recommend... There's like a wheel over there. If he does recommend something, I mean, we'll go check it out. But for right now, let's just, I guess, explore. All right, here is a box of stress. Here's the anxiety box over here. Uh, let's see. Can make him. I wonder if that's. Let's see if that does it. Oh, Your cornbread ain't cooked in the middle. Stop saying such hurtful things. I don't think this is sad. This looks more like anxious. Here's one of these pads. Maybe later. Give me another idea. No? I oh, know he's coming. He's coming. Do you want to stand on, on this right here? Let me belly box. I'll get you an apple. I guess I'll have to run around you until you get dizzy, because you can't lie down on your own. getting a little close to that one apple, but not quite getting it. No, I need you to just continue to lie down on your back so I can do... Not... No, it's not really happening. Hmm. Is there any... Is there one that's any closer? Like, if I... Seems like that is the closest one. That one right there. I don't think. I'm getting a little higher there. Oh, there we go. We knock one off. An apple a day, Moigle's brain starts to play. Hey, Moigle, take this. I don't feel the need for any food right now. He's mad. Alright. Why do I... Why did I need this? We just suggested it. I guess it's gonna stay there, I guess. Well, maybe if he calms down, I will be able... To offer it to him? Will he actually calm down or will he just stay there forever angry? He's still there. right here. May it serve you well. Not taking food right now. All right, he doesn't want that. All right, I guess we'll just get some points. Bribe him with points. For that many points, you could go to ride on a Ferris wheel. Tummy full. Now my brain is dying. I guess he's still angry, though. Me. 
if we can get tagged, poke Moigel to tag him back. Win by poking Moigel last before the timer runs out. have d demonstrated our superiority against our larger brother. He does not like to admit it, but we have beaten him in fair combat. And I guess he's not mad anymore. All right, here's the happy box. But he's not happy. Let's see. Well, there's another apple over here. I don't know if we need that. He hasn't been pointing out anything else for us to take. He only did it the one time. He hasn't done that after that. up there. And I guess that's an angry box over there. But I cannot get over there, even if I were to make him mad. But there is this. Ah, that explains that. He had a good cry to forget about his problems. And that allowed that solved my problem. What is this? Hmm. Alright. Do you have a plan to get that key? I do not. Do we Hey, I'm sure this key would be you. I don't see a pad around to jump on him. Hey, I'm sure this key would be useful. Well, I guess if I made him mad, maybe he'd throw me up there. Michael, you should get that key. All right, so I think I would get the key by angering you. I'm warning you, Michael. He's still not mad. You're just going to eat that anyway. There we go. You just have to know how to manipulate your brother's fragile emotional state to get him to threaten you with physical violence. Oof. The mood swings come hard and fast. I don't think we can move from this side. And there was... Oh, yeah, it's right here. Uh, progress? How do we want to do that? Help me plant seeds in my garden, okay? okay. Sure. Yippee! 
keep the birds from eating the seeds. When all the seeds are planted, we win. Lose if the birds eat five seeds. Press go to start. All right. No peeking for what? Oh, okay. Good luck for you. Okay. I understand. So we punch birds. I think the mini game is about punching birds. So they will try to get the seeds. I mean, this is really what scarecrows are for. I should probably look into getting one. I've been working on it. No, he almost had him filled. But it was all for naught. It was all for naught. Alright, so we need a blue switch to open this. I would guess this is another one of these deals where we're not going to be fast enough. Well, if he's happy, apparently this box activates. I want to play a game. Can we activate this box? How do we how do we open this box? Sure. I'll play whatever you want. Okay, it's going to be the high five game again. Let's see how we do. Alright, we succeeded at brother skin. We skinned the brother so many times. He is pleased, and he must give us points. This, okay, if we can make him really happy... He's not happy enough. He needs to be more happy than this. Can we take that flower pot? Like, I noticed this was bef here before. Yeah, we can grab it. I don't know what we would do with it. I don't know if we saw anything that would need this. Now let's just remember that it's here. All right, so I guess if I made him really happy, we'd do something to open that switch, probably, and then get in there. Well, let's just try it out anyway, just to make sure that it is a timed switch, and that I'm just not making assumptions here. Yeah, it is. Yeah, 
I don't think there was anything up there. All right, so we failed at the seeds. Is that a problem? Did we need to succeed at that? Like, if we go here, it doesn't seem like he is suggesting that we do this again. Okay, we can... Do you want some help planting your garden? Su I, we can suggest it again. Help me plant yeah, okay. Okay, we'll, we'll try that again. I don't really want to try it again. But I assume we have to. I wonder if there's anything you could bring with you into this arena to assist you. Like, something you could throw at the birds. Because as it is, it's a fair amount of space you have to cover. Once he gets a lot of seeds down. Like, at first, it's just not that much, but then eventually it's going to become this whole thing. Occasion, it does seem like I kill the birds. Most of the time, the birds survive my my dives. Oh no, it came back to life. Okay, we did it. I guess since we won, the birds will now stop attempt attempt. Okay, the, no, never mind. He had the scarecrow on him the whole time. He had him there the whole time. It was just it's inappropriate to put the scarecrow down until the plants are all planted. Let's play. I want to play a game. What game is it? Hey. Sure. Anything you want. Is it high five? It is high five. Give me some. Gotcha. Left. Over. Skin, brother. He's weak. Gotta hang. Hang on his leg. We gave our brother plenty of our skin, and it was extremely tight. We gained some. We gained more imaginary points in this. Oh, here's this thing. In the. I want to get to the water pump. Oh right, how do we do that? He's suggesting something now. How do we do this? We need oh, water right. It's because this used to be the happy box. It is not a happy box anymore. It is open. Because he is ecstatic due to the combination of seed planting success and also receiving skin from his brother. Uh, do I control him? The only thing it tells me to do is swipe. It's, it's one button. 
Okay, I, I hate... Oh, no, I can control him. Okay. I... I guess I should hit the switch and... All right, I guess we're done with that. He's... All right. Is that box still open? It is. So then we hit that. So I kind of control him. He, he doesn't stop. He just keeps moving. Oh. He keeps moving constantly. I can't make him stop, but I can alter his direction. Which is what we need to do. There we go. We made it inside. Three different switches up here. It's a oh my. Welcome back to Earth, little brother. Hmm? What are you doing down there? Hey Heigl, you wanna help me fix the water pump? Sure. Yes. Okay. Tell tell we will tell Hoigel to punch one of the colored switches. Punch the correct switch before the timer runs out. Gotta wait until the prompt changes to climb. Because if you don't, it just stays on dive. All right, we gotta make sure we change the camera so we're make it easier to walk forward. Faster, hit the yellow switch. I'm gonna say precision platforming in Floygan Bro. It's not. It's not Mario. Let's let's just say that. needed to stop moving so it turned into punch. Remember your prompt needs to be on screen before you press the button. Do not attempt to press the button before the prompt begins. All right. Hey. Hey. You want to do this thing? What you doing? This thing. This? Is it time to fix the pump? Is it time to fix the pump? Hey, yes, we want to fix the pump. Let's fix the pump. Yay! You know I want to fix the pump. Do not press the button until it changes to punch. I have to remember this.
Well, we once again failed at attempting to do the switches, which we have to do because we have to fix the water pump. I assume this will all be coming together at some point. Hey, Michael, is it time to fix the pump? Hey, Michael, you want yes. to fix the Yes. Yippee! why we would have to have a time limit to repair this to begin hey, Michael, with. You want to help me fix the water pump? Yes. Yes. Yay! I think, I mean, I don't know, but I think that the fact that there's some sort of time limit is just completely arbitrary. I mean, he says faster, but as we've seen, fast leads to failure. I, th I think the actual key is is slowness. You need speed. Speed is important, but actually, it's the reverse of speed. You need the absence of speed. Now, you might say this seems bad, but well, I'll, you, you just don't know anything about game design. Apparently, this game is extremely short. So, if the pe if you want the people to have their money's worth, hey, Michael, is it time to fix the pump? you need it to last as long as possible. No, he doesn't want to do it anymore. I want to play a game. Sure. I'm surprised that it's high five again. Who would have expected this? Give me some. 
Let's give some to our brother. Take some. Take it, brother. We, we got another point. We got another point. That seems like quite a lot to just get one point. I think it should be worth more, honestly. Do you want to fix the pump? Is it time to fix the pump? Is it time to fix it? Get over here and tell me it's time to fix the pump. Is it time to fix? We must fix. I don't know why we must fix, but we must. Look, either either we're going to fix this or we're going to give our brother some skin. So you tell me which sounds more pleasant. We did it. I feel no pleasure. I feel no sense of satisfaction. There is no joy welling within me for having completed this. I'm gonna give you five points for this. Wonderful. Yeah, what is that? Chimney vent. There are so many more pieces to get. You 
rather cute. I hate that. However, your cuteness has its uses. Remember the plan. Soften them up when they're all all and Gucci Gucci Goo. Call up and I'll send down the troops. <laughs> Got it. Good. Get out. <laughs> Once they're overrun with cats, they'll have to leave, and the junkyard will be mine. Look! Someone jumped out of the plane! Jumped? Looks more like pushed. <gasps> it's a kitten! She's stuck up there! We have to get her down! Okay, it looks like we've introduced a villain. Get on- stand on that thing. Yeah, there you go. That's right. Let me jump on your belly. Repeatedly. Let me smash your insides. Until they are unrecognizable and not and non-functional. Get back, pal. I mean it. Yow! That's not so cute. A talking cat. <laughs> is there anything on the roof I should be concerned with right now? There is an apple. There is a second apple. Alright, what are we doing with this cat? Cute kitty to Baron. Over. Baron here. Roger. Roger. Get on with it. I got a meeting out of the palm of my hand, Roger. Send in one of the boys. You heard her. Get down there and do your stuff. By do your stuff, do you mean murder? Hey, look! Another kitty! Is this a hit job on the Floygan brothers? Does this rich capitalist want to murder them to take their property? What lesson do you want? Tell me what lesson. Oh, okay, I guess I can't answer that right now. Uh, looking around to see where that was, that the kit, that the kitty was setting up barracks. Oh, here it is. It's throwing bombs at me. Can't get in there. All right, how do you want to handle this? Like maybe I could pick up the bombs. Yes, it's gonna go boom. All right, throw it back. There we go. Well, it's still going. Maybe I just have to do that a few times? Now. Where are you? Yikes, it's gonna go boom. <laughs> Don't know if that'll hit him. I 
I want to play a game. No. I want to play a game. Yikes, it's going to go boom. Nope. There we go. Is she still going? Well, the no the number usually is three times. It was not this time. It's, it's gonna go bold. I mm, would do we would we actually have to do it more? I'm not seeing like a a visual indication anywhere. Like those signs say, look over here. It's, it's gonna go bold. But I'm not really seeing anything that indicates how many times. The cat can survive bombs. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. Yet clearly, I mean, he had an animation when he was hit by the explosion. Fine, we'll play a game. Choose a game this time. High five. He loves high five. Oh, he faked me out. I slowly build up the points that I will use to bribe my brother for... I don't know, favors? Still, I've never, not really clear on the whole points thing. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. So if I'm looking in there, it doesn't really seem like there's, like there's like a thing to stand on that's underneath those sandbags, but it doesn't really seem like there's anything else to hit him with, unless I should use the bomb somewhere else in the environment. Like, I guess that could always be a possibility. But he does have, like, a, a hurt animation when we get him with the bomb, which kind of... It, implies that we're doing damage to him. Not really sure. Like, once you figure out how to hurt him, I don't really know why we would need to do it so many times. Point at him. It's a bomb. Look out. No, we're not really like mentioning the cat or anything. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. I guess our brother's talking with the with the small cat. The brother does not seem to notice the second cat, the the bomb throwing cat, which is strange because it seems like it's a more attention getting cat. Oh, here he comes. Only throwing two at two at once now. 
He's getting serious. I wanna play a game. Yeah, we are playing a game right now. I mean, you could help me with these bombs. You could, but you're, you cho you are choosing not to. Hey, Hoigel, how about playing a game? You're making the active decision to not help me with these bombs. We always could go to that talk to that other cat, I suppose, and see if it has anything to say. Do you have anything to say? You just scratched me. Maybe I will throw this cat at the other cat. I didn't mean to throw it in that direction. Try throwing it straight this time. No, he's like automatically just turning to the side and throwing it. He's not letting me throw it in there. Well, it doesn't want me to throw the, the cat at the other cat. It just doesn't want me to do it. Can we teach him about that bomb? To teach me that, you'll need a few more points. No, we can. It seems like we're supposed to be in in combat with this cat. It looks like that. Oh, okay, they've got a little bit of a different text right there. Kitty bummer. Let's get him. Hey. Hey, Michael, that's a bad cat. Okay. We got we got his attention. Yes. Yay! Okay, the the mini game actually had not started yet is the thing. Help Moigle throw the bombs at Evil Bomb Cat. Win by blowing up the Bomb Cat nine times! Okay. Is it the exact same thing we've been doing? Alright, he's throwing more bombs. Got a little different animation there. can destroy another bomb.
I mean, he seems like he can handle it pretty well. Well, if he does get blown up though one more time though, then we lose. So, let's try to help him out. Except, oh, that's let's get away from that. Oh, he got blown up a third time, I think. Yep, we lost. Hey that's a bad yes, it is a bad cat. We should get rid of him. Alright, so yes, I know. So, our brother can throw bombs at the cat, but our brother also does have his own health meter. So if either one of us gets blown up three times, we do lose. And if a bomb is about to blow up, it doesn't seem like he moves away from it. Like, as you saw, he was walking towards a bomb right there to, to grab it. Yes, it's gonna go Oh, he got blown up. I think he has only one hit point left. Stay away from that, please. No, he got hit. He got hit again. Yes, we will get rid of the bad cat. We will get rid of him. We can't leave this bad cat in our junkyard. He's a bad cat. Ugh.
I got both of us. Yeah. Making that mistake. Pressing the button before I've come to a stop. Because I have to come to a stop for the button prompt to change from dash to pick up. And I keep not doing that. I also have a lot of trouble actually getting it over this thing. As you can see. You're a mess, brother. <laughs> Yikes, it's gonna go boom. Oh, God, we got him. The cats have nine lives. So as you can see, the brother is has flawless aim when he throws a bomb. The only problem is that if a bomb is about to explode, he will walk towards it. Okay, he doesn't actually have flawless aim. He can miss. It seems, though, he at least he gets it over the barrier a lot more than I do. Fat. I went. Uh, that one started flashing pretty much immediately. It's 
Kiddies history. Yeah. I hope you didn't take it personally. All right, we murdered the bomb cat. There's a propeller here. Five points for this. Thank you for the points. All right, well, this is where we did the apple tree. It's just something we should be doing. Oh, is this one of the things you need for your project? Look, look at it. Yeah, that's what you wanted. It was one of the things on your list. You got it. Please do a thing. What? Well, I don't know what that is you're doing in that workshop, but please use it. We went through enough to actually get that thing. But, I mean, we murdered one of the assassin cats. There is still a second assassin cat that was on that blimp. Mm-hmm. Four pieces to go. I want to play a game. All right. What game could you possibly want to play? Which one is it? It's high five. Alright, I hope you enjoyed watching watching the ritual of the brothers rubbing their skin against each other. The thing they do constantly, many times, every day. Alright, so no cutscene or anything started. We didn't get any story material after doing that. So when is this second cat assassin supposed to come in? Where is the second cat assassin? Bring him before me so that we may dispose of him like we did his brother. Our brother is not actually doing anything. We still have this cat. It's a spy cat. Well, I mean, he's standing on that thing. I guess we should do this thing. I don't think- I don't know if there's actually a reason for us to do this right now. But he was standing on it. He's hungry. Okay. Well, there was an apple on the roof. We could got got it. Could have gotten that. We could have gotten it. Then we could have given it to our brother. Tommy's growling, All right, hold on. Here you go. Never figured out the mystery of these switches. Well, I mean, I guess, I guess if I did the if I did the thing, well, no, we did this one. We did we did do this switch. There was another switch. Did we do this switch? Maybe it wasn't this one. There was something else. But I guess if we make him really happy, we can open this up and then get him to give us the piggyback ride over to the blue switch over here. If we can. Make him happy. Oh, wait, there's an apple over there. Can I get that? I mean, I guess if I got on top of that and then, like, jump down. Can I get on that? Probably I can't get on that ledge because I don't remember getting to that wheel. I don't remember that happening. How dare you! I will guess. Michael, you're such a maroon. Why are you trying to hurt my feelings? 
And I'm saying that the flower that you you picked, it was it was maroon. You're misunderstanding. I wonder if he's still hungry. Oh, you are so cute, kitty, kitty. And I'm all yours, baby. I don't think I like that. You better now. You and me both. I don't know how I would feel about that if I got a new pet cat and the cat spoke to me in such a tone of voice. Not sure how, not sure how that would, how would I feel about it? He's really happy? Does that mean that- Okay, that box is open. The box is open. Get over here and carry me on your back because my legs are tiny. There's like- Oh, uh, there's like momentum. So when he turns... There's a dog. Do they have a dog? I don't think they mentioned having a dog. No, oh, there's the dog. The dog is not. The dog is not trained. Do you still want you still hungry? I understand that. Hey, do you play a game with fish? Sure. Yes. Yippee. Run and dive to catch Spitz by the tail. Win by catching Spitz three times. Lose if the timer runs out. Press go to start or help for more instructions. Look, we don't lose if the timer runs out. We've already lost. All of us. We've all already lost. Go get a boy. Get a boy. Come on, bring it back. Yes, I want to play a game with Spitz. Yes. Run and dive to catch Spitz by the tail. Do it three times. Go get a boy. Come on, bring it back. We did it. We caught him once. Okay, so you don't dive at where he is, you dive at where he's going to be. I don't think you could put a hammer lock on a dog. That's like physically impossible. I won. I feel like a winner. I did it. It's, he dug, he buried this engine, and now he dug it up. I 
feel like such a champion. We got four of the seven. Only the trash can, barrel, and bucket remain. But where could they possibly be? Still no cutscene. I want the evil capitalist to appear and send his second cat assassin after us. It's not happened yet. All right, let's just, I guess, continue walking around the junkyard and see what hot spots we have not used yet. So this whole section, we, I think we were done with. There was the this, and then using the thing to open the thing, and then getting in here and doing this thing. And then it kind of ends with a dead end right here. But well, you can jump off that. And... Doesn't seem like we can get past this right here. And I don't see any hot spots around. No hot spots in the water. Ah, uh, that was too deep for him. So there is that wheel up there. We can't seem to get to it. Uh, there is this. There is the one where if we make him anxious? Like, we know how to make him mad. And we know how to make him happy. I'm actually not sure about this one making him nervous. Where is he? Teach him something. Um, how about the yo yo? Send about it. Just one smooth arc up and over. Got it. Zen arc smoothness. Yeah. I guess that. I guess we succeeded at teaching him something? I suppose so. How do I make you doubt yourself? I want you to be- I want you- I want to induce anxiety in you, which is what I think this is saying here. is still not opening, even though he is crying. Michael, 
You're such a maroon. You're gonna make me sad. <laughs> well, I mean, it's clear that this is not working. I know punching him would make him mad. Feeding him would make him happy. What will he do now? I don't know what he'll do now. What emotion do you have to be feeling? Give me a hug, you big lug. Not for nothing, I won't. Oh, I have to, I have to bribe him to get some brotherly skin. I understand. You want something? You gotta give something. Crow, crow, quit. For that many points, you could have gotten an ice cream cone. He's leaving me hanging up here. He's leaving me hanging. Well, I can access the menu, but I cannot actually move around. Like, I can save. And so, I guess... This was the end of the Floygan brothers. As we continue to just stand here. Let's play tag. Wait, no, no. Too sad to do that. Okay, we broke out of the hug. We broke out of the endless hug animation, so the Floygan brothers can continue to live on. What game could you possibly? What if I said no? No. Well, don't play a game with me then. Hug. Not right now, maybe later. No hugs for right now. So we've been all around this junkyard. I don't see anything else to really pick up or use. But our brother does seem to enjoy this cat. So maybe if I threatened it, maybe that would get him to do what we want. Just an idea. Maybe if he watches us abuse the cat. No, he just he saw us do that and he didn't care. That box is not open. You know, it's important to introduce your pets to one another. Here you go. Mm, doesn't seem like they're interacting. Oh, wait, there's something else behind here. There's box of ang- a giant spider? 
like a target on its back. Aww, what a cute kitty. Aww, what a cute human. Cute kitty to Roger. Uh oh, cutscene. Roger. Uh, uh, whatever. Send another cat. Ooh, another one. <laughs> All right, our, our dog has been taken captive. Are you ready for another boss battle? Because I know I am. All right, what's he doing? Well, I mean, first we know we need to activate this scene. Protect Moigel from the bullets as he works to release Spitz from the cage. Moigel needs to fix nine things to win. Lose if Moigel is hit three times. All right, got to protect him. Got to protect him from... What is it that is being shot out here? I'm not... What is, what is that? There's a, oh, they're, they're bullets. They're living bullets. He mentioned the racket. Let's see. Is that around? I thought I did think I... S yeah, there it is. You can always use a tennis racket. You can always use a tennis racket. If you were to ask me what these things are, I would not have thought bullets. I'm just not seeing them as bullets. But, I mean, who am I to doubt the Floygan brothers? From that other, from that side. Stuck in, doggy prison. Stuck in doggy prison. Well, we just have to try it again now, don't we? Don't we? Don't we? Oh my gosh! Yes. I guess I should probably just stay very close to him. I guess they have to be hit into something like a wall or something to actually kill them. If they don't actually collide with anything, it seems that they survive my racket. I 
hit it into him. That's loser talk. Yes. We will free the dog no matter how many times it takes. No matter how many. I succeeded. The second cat assassin made it out. Will we encounter it again? There's the bucket. Another puzzle piece obtained. Come, brother. Witness the majesty. Thank you. Also, come witness the bucket. It's exactly what you needed for your project. That's it. That's what I wanted. My Soon, brother. Soon you will have all the pieces. You will put them together. And then... And then the people of this world will discover how things really are. But until then, we just have to survive. You have to survive the attempts for this mysterious capitalist to take over our, our junkyard for some reason. We need a trash can and a barrel. He is very sad. I'm not sure why he is so sad. Oh, right. Bef wait, before the... Something we can do is right before that battle began, I did find that behind here was an anger box. And a spider. See, there it is. I don't see the spider. Now oh, there's the spider. Am I poisoned? It appears to be that is what is happening. Okay, the poison is temporary. Brother, I need you over here. The box is here. Respond to your emotional state. Spider! This will open up when Weigel gets really mad at me. That's good to know. Not right now, maybe later. Where are you? I need you over here. So I can feel your anger.
come for me, brother. Alright, he hit us over here. Finally, we, we made it to the spider caves of the Floygan brothers. Look, brother. We found it. Can brother come? Hey, Michael, another part to your secret project. Come on. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. Brother fears the spiders. Antibiotics, now. Do I need to bribe do I need to bribe him? The bribe screen did come up there. Maybe I get out if I go there, but I would prefer to bribe brother to get in here and take this thing. Of course, doing so is a bit difficult because of the spider who is constantly trying to poison me. Roger. Roger. Oh, there's another cutscene. Roger that. Over. <gasps> it must be a whole winner! Another bomb cat. He opened up a new passageway for us. Oh, I mean, we're... Okay, so we're, we're here, even though the cutscene indicated that we were not, but okay. Hoigle needs a scary skeleton key. Punch yellow and red switches to extend pipes. Punch the green switches to move the three platforms. Be careful. You wouldn't want to fall. There is the key over there. We can extend the pipes if we so choose. It's kind of hard to see what's on these other platforms because the camera is poor, you might say. Ah, you see, we have to, we have to get some speed because, of course, there is a time limit on that. But of course, you're not surprised. You knew it was coming, because I know you're sharp and observant. You knew that was going to happen. Well, I went a little early. doesn't pay to be impatient when you are one of the Floygan brothers. You need patience. You need balance. You need clarity of mind. So all we need is a lock for this key. So there's 
there any other exit here? I don't think there is. Alright, let's head on back. We got gotta find some place to stick this key into. And what's going on with our brother? Now, brother can enter here if he... I mean, he still fears the spiders, but at least he can go inside there. However, we heard our brother call out in terror. Well, for what reason? Oh, there he is. Never mind. Are you doing okay? And I guess he's doing fine. We did see that one animation of the, um, that one cat that blew up the entrance to a tunnel. Now, where was that tunnel? Let's go looking around. Let's go looking around for it. Look around for the tunnel. Let's see if we can locate it. There it is. That would be the blocked tunnel. The cat assassin went in here. But for what reason? What do they hope to gain? I saw an angry box and an anxiety box. Oh, uh, there we go. A bit curious about not your best where we needed to go. Food. Oh, okay, we're playing. Well, if we get an apple or anything, we can do something for him. As for right now, we need his rage. Doesn't seem like anything's happening. I see the cat over there. Hmm. Well, I don't. I'm not seeing anything visibly happening. Or if it is, it's not a very... It's not like a very obvious effect. Ah, that, that b kitty is throwing bombs. We greatly enjoyed the first bomb kitty fight. I was just... Hoping now for a second one. So this is exactly what I wanted. It's a bomb! Look out, Morgo! I just can't... He just can't do it. I'll be right there! Now he can. Come, brother. Another cat life for us to take. Another cat with a bomb. Let's take him out. That's right. Yes. Yeah! Nine times again. It is of no surprise. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. Ah, this is slightly different. You will be sorry. So when it comes to me, who should I pass it to? Yikes, it's gonna go boom. 
I guess it doesn't really matter right now. I mean, no, okay, the timer's going again. I guess the timer is just how long do you have to hold it. notice that the what you have to do is just figure out how to throw it to the the cat just like at the instant it's about to explode because the, the cat will throw it away instantly We're going to do it. Of course, we're going to do it. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. I can't wait anymore. It's taking a while for this one to start flashing. Too early. You will be sorry. I can't wait anymore. Yikes, it's gonna go boom. I can't wait anymore.
Nope, thought I might have had one more. I mean, we could just rush the cat. He's not like he's not protected. Where did it go? It's not like he's protected by by sandbags this time. There's another kitty bomber. Let's get him. Another cat with a bomb. Let's. Yes. Yay! I'm sure that if we rushed the cat, we wouldn't even need to do this. Like you just throw it back and forth between themselves until it starts flashing and then the speed of its flashing is just how many throws you have left before it explodes so this is a slower one no he still had one more I guess yep, there it is Pretty slow. One, Throw it to me. two, three, four. Okay, that's the slow one. Yikes, it's gonna go. That's a medium one. One, two, three. Okay, that's the medium one, which is three. That's the fast one, so one, two. Is that the fast, fast one? No, that's the medium one. Here, 
that's the slow one. One, two, three, four. Last one. Those are and that would be the the oil drum or garbage can, whichever one it was. So we know where the final two items are. That this is a sadness box. We know how to make him sad. All right, time for insults. Feelings? Wiggle's got no room at the Brain Motel. You're making me sad. Why are you doing this to me? Wiggle's tongue is like an egg, soft boiled. <laughs> Fill the lake with your tears of anguish, brother. <laughs> All right, the lake, the water level has increased. Oh, don't be mean to me. Now this bridge is here. Another one of those yellow boxes. Like I feel like we did see him have this, have this particular emotion, the yellow one. We have seen that. It's like a weird mask by this hubcap. What is, I don't know what that is. I don't know if we could pick that up. Yeah. This scary mask will make Moigle twitchy with fear. Okay, I can scare him? Okay. That, is, that activated the yellow here. I guess to activate his fear, we had to have something in the environment that was capable of doing that. Hmm. Ah, uh, that that opened that up. Can we take this with us? Let's try to take it with us. We can. Okay. So if we, as long as we're holding this, then we have the means to terrify our brother for our own ends. Uh, let's see. So where did he come out? Like, he came out somewhere. The boss, I mean. Where was that? Because I want his item. I want his thing. Or rather, my brother wants his thing. His thing is needed in order to... ...continue the invention. Whatever the invention is. I want to play a game. I, I do not want... Look, this is no game, brother. This has never been a game. You need to start taking things seriously for once in your life. Oh good. The mask teleported with me. We know that the two final objects are available to us. I know how to get to one of them. The only issue is that our brother will not follow us there because he is afraid of spiders. There is one fear box around here that we were not able to activate. So maybe now is the time to do that. Yeah, it's over there. Well, I mean, he's saying he's hungry, but I'm sure 
the fear response will be more powerful than hunger. Where is he, by the way? Let's put this down. It's point. Which seems to... Yeah. That frequently gets him to start coming over. Okay, he's way over there. He's way over there. Get them all scared up. Anybody got the for nine one one? That is indeed an amusing joke. All right, we're finally in here. Oh, look. Is this, yeah, it's the thing. I'm gonna give you five points for this. Brother, you come over here and take your stupid thing. This is what you want. Hey, Moigel, another part to your secret project. This is exactly what I've been looking for. The penultimate part of the machine. Only one part to go. And we know where it is. But our brother will not go there. Alright, what about this... This, like, wheel on a stage up here? We haven't done anything with this, but what is it that we're supposed to do? Is there some... Can we use this in some way to get our brother to overcome his fear and go into the spider cave? There's, like, a ball over there. Why a ball? A beach ball, but no beach. Perfect ball to play catch with. Hey, let's play the wheel of laughter. Sure. Yes. I could use some laughter. Try to make Moigo laugh. Stop the wheel on the correct color so Hoigo will do something funny. Win if Moigo's happiness meter hits the top. Make it stop on blue. We did not stop on now make it stop on green. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. What manner of abominations are these Floygans? They are not from this world. Stop on blue. You don't care about my needs. I mean gr yes, but that doesn't have much to do with my ability at this game. I think I'm, a, me too. think I'm a bit unclear as to why he has to get the right color for, in order to do some sort of performance to amuse his brother. I really needed to see you fall into pieces. It made my day. My face hurts from laughing. Your face is hurting me too. Thanks for the laughs. I'd like to thank you by telling you the big secret, but I can't. I don't have all the parts I need. Ah, we need to get your final part. Well, we know where the final part is now, don't we? Yes, we do. I guess we cannot take the part ourselves. 
we need him to do it. Okay, there's there it is. It's in there. You want to get over here? I'll be right there. Please. There's the key. I mean, I guess we don't need to pick up that key. You want to? Uh oh. Whatever's behind this gate must be pretty spooky. Mm-hmm. I got better things to do. No, you don't. The key to all of your ambitions is right behind here. Don't you want to find out what it lies within? He is very afraid to come in. Can his anger overcome his fear? No, it appears not. Well, let's see if the cat is afraid of spiders. Oh, now he's angry. His anger was t was delayed. A delayed reaction. Yes. It's good to see things from different perspectives at times. Sure, let's play a game. You choose a game this time. Oh, we're playing something different. We're playing tag. If Moigle gets tagged, poke Moigle to tag him back. Win by poking Moigle will last before the timer runs out. Uh, we did play tag before. That's correct. But can the camera... Okay, the camera did it. The camera pierced the, the ground. I wasn't sure if it would, but it did. have enough time. Kind of wanted him to run in after me. Alright, let's try this again. He's terrified to go in here. I just can't stay mad at you, you little log. And I'm glad you can't get big little. Too far of a throw. It does look like I can bribe him to do it, but the spider just comes and gets me before I can actually start bribing him with anything. All right, well, fortunately, the spider does not seem to be doing anything. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. There are spiders. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. There are indeed. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. What if we lied to him and told him that there were no spiders? Spiders in there. I'm not going in there. There's only spiders in here if you believe there's spiders. 
I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. But look how many points I'm offering you. There's spiders in there. So many delicious points. Uh, I can't bribe any more than nine. Nine is the maximum. I guess. Oh. Okay, I just punched the spider. I guess that wasn't up. No, no. He's, he's scared. He's scared. Okay, if I disable the spider... Is he... Oh. I, oh. Spiders. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. There's spiders in here. All right, well, the spiders don't s spiders don't stay down for long at all. Only a few seconds. I'm not going in there. There's spiders in there. I think he like comes in a little bit. But not much. Does he run away when the spider gets closer to him? Yeah. We even have dramatic music for him running out of the area. Where did he go? Guess he's still scared. Just till still too scared. The dog ran in there. Is there a reason that the dog might want to run in there? I mean, it just was really to attack me, but. He doesn't seem to be scared anymore now. Though he is hungry. But like, is he going to get it? It's still too far away. When I mean, the spider sees him, it seems like the spider just kind of makes a beeline towards him. Seems like there's a certain point where he stops following me down there. 
Well, no, you should be over here. You should be getting your thing. Well, he's out of here. Like, you could have picked that up at any point. Alright, so clearly it's not that. He had the opportunity. He was close enough to get that thing, and he chose not to. He does, yeah. I don't know if we can use this to attack. You don't, you don't really aim it or anything. I believe there was an apple up on top of this roof if you want to do your thing. You want to stand on this thing so I can crush you. If that's what you want to do. Like this thing right here. I'm pretty sure you are. Do I have to bribe him to eat something? Food is repulsive to me at the present time. Take this, brother. We will serve you well. Okay, there it is. Are you ready for my lessons now? Fine. There's spider. Lift up, catch, hide, and seek. I can... Oh, for 50 points, I can teach him to overcome... Was that there before? I mean, I know lift up, catch, hide and seek. Is spider new? Maybe that appeared after we encountered the spider in there. All right. Let's get some points. Get some family points. Play high five. That's like one point. Mom, play tag. Let's play tag. Let's play tag. Pity I can't bet him for points. 
Like, say, could he put his 18 points up on the line? Let's play tag! Hooray! Got it! Not it! We have 32 points. Let's play tag. Let's play tag. You have to be interested. This is the only way we can get points. You want me to teach you something? Well, I mean, I don't... I could teach him other games. Like... Catch. I could do that. But let's see if I did. Catch is five points. Running race is nine points. Let's play tag. More times. Hmm. I feel hesitant to actually spend points. Let's play a game of tag. Let's play tag. We won two more points. Let's play tag. We won two more points. Ooh, that's enough. Oh my. Welcome back to Earth, little brother. I demand more tag, brother. Tag. tag. I cannot sate my hunger for tag. Tag, brother. Let's play tag. Yay. Yay. Oh, good. I was unsure about the end there when the camera decided not to do its job. Tag! Sorry, I will hug. Hey, sailor. Give me a hug. I got better 
things to do. How dare you? Expressing my brotherly love and you saying you have better things to do. Yes, tag. The symbol of our fraternity. There is no action that can be used to demonstrate the closeness of the brotherly bonds than a game of tag. For points, you understand. Brother points. I now wonder why, when I was growing up, did my family not have a system of points that were constantly being earned and taken away? It gives you an extra incentive to live your life. Let's play tag. Not right now, maybe later. In a virtuous way, because then you would be able to earn points for doing so. Like tag? Do you mean like tag? Let's play tag. Not right now, maybe later. No, now it must be now. What about high five? Do you want to play high five? High five. He does want to play high five. Skin me, brother. Peace oh. cake. Brother, tag brother. Yeah, yippee. Tag. Chase me round this fence. For a while, my brother is overall faster than I am. He is unable to handle the turns as I do, which is why this fence is to my advantage. Yes! Yippee! You know, brother, I question your commitment to your project when you know where the final piece is, yet you refuse to go get it. You are allowing someone else, that spider, to keep you from your goal, even though your goal is in sight. I question how much you really want to complete the project. Let's play tag. Yay! so close that we can taste it. It's tantalizingly close. Give me that final point, brother. I don't care how I get it.
No, oh, he's, he's getting me. No, he got me three in a row with that. I was doing so well on these high fives. Yet he was able to combo me with his tricks. But st I'm still superior at tag. We break the limit. We have 51 points. Now it is time for education. You must overcome your fear. A full belly is a learning necessity. Fine, you need to eat. Let's see, where have we seen an apple? Well, there was one, like, on the other side of this sign. If there was a way of, like, dropping onto it. I mean, it's, like, right there. But I don't know actually how we would get that. We can't, like, walk on the other side of this railing. I don't actually know how you get that. There's also one over there. we open up that wheel, I wonder if we can... I wonder if we can go over here and drop down on it. Yeah, this is what I was thinking of. Can I land on that? Well, I didn't, but it seems like you could. It looks like you can do that. Okay, we made it. If I drown, I think I come back with the item that I have, but I guess we'll find out. Yeah, there's the apple. Where did he go? Where is my brother? Where are you? Hey, Moigle. Want an apple? I got better things to do. No, you don't. You get over here and you eat this. Oh, there he is. Eat. Take this. Full. Now my brain is starving. It is time to learn about spiders. I don't know how. You show me. Should we go to the spiders now?
He said, come show him. Like, I, I would... I would want to look a little more direction than that, but I guess we're going to the spiders now. I'm not interested. Yeah, you are. I got better things to do. Yeah, I, I know there's spiders in there. There's spiders in there. I understand the bit about there being spiders in here. Okay. Well, let's save and see about th this. Here's the last piece. Actually, he's going to poison me before I can do anything there. Not right now, maybe later. Look out, Boydle! Spider! No! I'm busy. Are you? Hey, Boydle! Here's the last piece of your secret project. I'm not going in there. I thought you wanted to see the spider. I mean, he saw it, now he's afraid of it. I thought you I thought we were talking about being afraid of spiders. Is too frightened for hugs. Okay, there we go. There's the hug. Do you want not want to know about spiders? Ah, uh, hungry once again. Are there any apples still on this? There is that one. There's two. Oh, do you want to do your thing over here? The thing that you do? No, just get get on the thing here. Let me belly bounce. I'll get you an apple. Hey! Ah, yes. Shame that we can't just pick that up. Something, and something get, did get knocked down. All right. Come over here and eat the apple. Just come, come over here and do it. Take this, brother. May it serve you well. Not taking food right now. Hey, Moigo, take this. It is not. You admitted it was not. Brother, may it serve you well. Not taking food right now. Okay. 
Let's put this here. And just clear a path. Just like get everything out of his way. Oh, okay, that helped him out. I guess he didn't like the key. All right. Eat. I don't feel the need for any food right now. I mean, I disagree about this. I'm gonna drop this. I'm gonna try to teach you something. You better not say you're hungry. Want me to learn? Feed me. Hey. All right. Just grab this. Here, take this. Coming full. Hmm. I wanna play a game. Hey, Moigo, take this. I don't feel the need for any food right now. I wanna play a game. What game would you like to play? Now let's play high five with our loving why are we over why are we over here with a spider? What happened? I'm not entirely sure why we teleported over here. Alright, is the apple where we left it? It is, good. Give me a hug, you big lug. I think I'm okay now. Alright, come over here. Here he comes. All right, maybe let's just save here. All right, do you want to learn something? A full belly is a learning necessity. Okay. Do you want to eat this? Take this, brother. May it serve you well. He ate it, okay. I am ready for my lessons now. He puts on the learning hat. Teach you about spiders. I don't know how you show me. Like this over here? Like there's a spider right here. Do I have to teach you about the spider while the spider is in view? I'm not entirely sure what you want. Okay, you see him? I'm gonna teach you about the spider. I lost those points. It doesn't seem like he is, uh... doesn't seem like he is... has overcome his fierce spiders. Okay, so something... something happened because we lost the points. Okay, he's afraid. Now. Let's see. Okay, Spider is gone. Like, that's not there anymore. Apparently, he learned the lesson. Hey, sailor. Give me a hug. So, if we go back, is he still frightened of spiders? Or is he has he overcome it? I can't tell... I can't tell what the game is trying to tell me. All right. It's it's right there. Here's the last piece of your secret project. I'm not going in there. No, there's still spiders in here. 
Even though apparently he learned the lesson of not being scared of spiders, he is still not going in here. Oh, he, actually, he's running in here now. Want, okay, but the spider is up. No, he is afraid of that. It, nope. Waving the white flag. Get the, get the thing. Get the thing. It's right there. should give me a hundred points for this. I'm not entirely sure what happened. I punched the spider into him and then he sat on it and killed it? That's what I wanted. This is it. The final part. Don't try to stop me. No. Regardless, he got the final piece of his abomination. What was he building here the whole time? All the pieces have been collected. Tell me about your forbidden truths. Or do we have to do the wheel now to do that? Because we did the wheel before. And he said that he couldn't tell us what it was. Because we still had... Um, he still had pieces to find. So, let's go back to that wheel. I don't know why he wouldn't have been able to tell us just because he hadn't found all the pieces, but apparently it was a big deal for him. Oh, that's, that's, okay, there we go. So do I. Or can we can we just say to do the we wheel here? Anything you want to play is fine by me. Yippee! Actually, I forgot how we activated the wheel. Now this is just high five. All right, we'll play high five. Left over. Low down. Shut up. Give me some. Gotcha. The larger Floygan brother does not have enough skin. He requires more skin from his brother. Will he ever will he ever have enough skin to satisfy himself? Perhaps not. All right, I think we can like point at that. I think that's I think that's what we did. Get over here and use this wheel. We're going to make you laugh. Inform me of your secrets. I must know. I crave this knowledge. Your knowledge will be mine. I'm getting a face sprain from Grim. I must know the secret. Stop with a horse play. The secret of the Floygans. I must know. How can I rest if I do not know? me hurts. All of me hurts. You don't care about my needs. All I want is your secret. I must extract it. We still have one more. Tell me. Tell 
me your secret. I must know. Ah, uh, Hoyle, you are the best! I knew there was some reason you were my brother. Now, I will show you the surprise. <laughs> <laughs> okay, big boy, I'll bite. What's that do? I'll show ya! Oh, I thought he was going to blow up the whole junkyard. I'll get you yet, you... 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 Floygans. Do they even know who that is? That was impressive, Moigle, even for you. Wait, that's not all. <laughs> there, that's the surprise. Oh, Moigle, I thought you'd forgotten. So, is that it? Didn't you get me a present, big boy? A pony, a puppy? That's a, just a horrific expression, and I guess that's what we're ending it on. That was Floygan Brothers. We'll just end it on that freeze frame. I suppose. Wow. This was terrible. I think I like the Dreamcast less after playing this. I don't understand why they felt they had to release this. And I mean, I don't, I'm not saying that we needed a resolution to the evil businessman story. Because this was just episode one. And whatever the ongoing overarching story that was going to be. In episodes two, three, four, five, six, seven. You know, just the endless episodic series of Floygan Brothers. We, you know, we'll never know. We'll never know what it was going to be. I'm sure it was going to be just as good as this, and it would have been a Sega classic if uh, they had actually, if they were actually able to do it. Um, it's just, isn't it a crime that the Floygan brothers never actually got going with a very early example of the episodic video game model? The Floygan brothers were ahead of their time. Visionaries. That never got the credit that they needed. Isn't that a tragedy? Congratulations, you've completed Floygan Brothers Episode 1. Press go to return to the junkyard. See if you can find our... Fun... Extras. I do not desire your extras. No, don't bring me back to- No, don't bring me back to the game. Exit. Exit the game. Welcome to the Floygan Brothers video game. No, I don't want to be welcomed. So we did it. We completed the game. There is also this option for go online. Do I want to use my Dreamcast dial-up modem to go onto SegaNet to download the DLC? So you want to know about a fun thing about this game is that... It was supposed to have monthly DLC um, for one year. So 12 months, each month would get a little bit of DLC. Um, only one month came out, and then it stopped. But good news! In 2017, developers of the game modified a save file to unlock all of the DLC... So now you are able to access all of those goodies that no one was ever able to access before. There's nothing much. It's just like like a hat for a character, you know, some different clothes. It's not like a big thing or anything. Um, I mean, it wasn't because at the time... Who's to say if the if the Dreamcast owner would actually have, would actually be able to access, would actually be able to use their system to go online, you know? You couldn't really stow away that much stuff because, you, I mean, who, 
you don't know if the Dreamcast owner is going to actually go online. It's not really something that's taken for granted like now. Also, all of the DLC was on the disc because it's not like the Dream the Dreamcast didn't have like storage you could write to. They had the VMUs, which were the memory cards. So basically, when you when you went online to get the DLC, basically all you were doing was modifying your save file so the DLC that was on the disc would be unlocked. Because it's not like you could actually download anything and save it to the VMU, aside from something very basic. So that's how DLC worked in the, in the instances of a Dreamcast game that would have it. I don't remember many games having DLC. Like, I, I remember when I played Skies of Arcadia back then, that had a couple of things that you could unlock if you went online to SegaNet. And I did that. But, I mean, all you're doing is just unlocking something that's on the disc. Because, once again, it's not like you have any storage or anything there. But, it's, all these years later, the remaining DLC had been unlocked. So, isn't that a wonderful thing? Well, this was Floygan Brothers, Episode 1, a very late game for the Dreamcast. Um, and, man, it's miserable. It is just miserable. I don't know why anyone wanted to make this. I really don't understand that Bernie stole our quote now about how this was going to do for Sega what the Mario Brothers did for for Nintendo. Like, why would he even say that? Maybe he didn't actually see the game. Maybe he didn't see it. He just saw the name Floygan Brothers and said, well, I mean, maybe that's like a Mar maybe that's our Mario competitor. Like, maybe he didn't know anything else about the game. Who could say? I don't know. But obviously, uh, this gets an Erico. I don't think I don't think we have to question that. In fact, it's going to get the... Um, hold on. It's going to get the big Erico. Hi there. I'm Hoigel Floygen, and I'd like to welcome you to... Hey, I'm Michael Floygen. Erico is extremely concerned about what is happening here. To the game. She does not like this at all. So that's what this game is getting. It's getting the lowest score yet. Big Erico looking on in, in, in extreme concern. Extreme concern. Also, you might be wondering, I said I was going to play this for an hour. Why did I play this for so long? Well, that's the thing. In Floygan Brothers' world, only a half an hour has passed. It might have felt like three. It wasn't. Only 30 minutes have passed. It just felt like it was. I know. Your clocks may say that three hours passed. They too were fooled by Floygan Brothers. So be, be aware it's not actually the time you think it is. Be aware that only around a half an hour has passed and your mind has time has dilated time. That is the experience of Floygan Brothers. Um, is it the worst Dreamcast game I've played? Is it worse than Blue Stinger? Welcome to the Floygan Brothers video game. This yeah. Game yeah, it is. This is worse than Blue Stinger. No. Then what um well, the Pretty certain this is the worst Dreamcast game I've played. Um, there's the ring. That one, that one's tough. Yeah, that one is very tough. About whether or not this is worse than the ring. Oh man, I don't know. At least this was short. The ring does make you play for a while. Man, I don't. That's a that's a toss up for me. That is a toss up about if is this worse than the ring? I can't. Ah, man, I don't know. I don't think I can make that decision. I don't think. I don't know. Huh. Well, I guess. I mean, we probably should put that to a vote. I suppose. Let's let's try to get a vote up here. Let's see if we can do that. Okay, it's up. Vote one for Floygan Brothers worse, or two for Terror's Realm worse. Which do you think is worse? 
One for Floygan Brothers, two for Terror's Realm. Well, it looks like people are saying that they think Floygan Brothers is worse. Floygan Brothers is basically turning into Pac-Man here. I mean, maybe this is just like recency bias. You, you, like right now, you just experienced Floygan Brothers while the ring is more of a memory. So this might not be the most accurate, but it's a pretty overwhelming vote for Floygan Brothers as being the worst. So I guess that's what we're going to... Um, that's what the vote came out to. That's what the vote came out to. Um, I just felt... I just felt like I had to keep playing this game. I couldn't let it win. I had to let it know in the end that it lost before I turned it off. It had to know. It had to know. <laughs> 